What is up and is going on guys, Simpsy here and welcome back to another episode of my FIFA 15 Newcastle United career mode. In today's episode we have two matches as always, the first of which is against Barcelona. We've got two home matches, this is in the semi-finals of the Champions League and we also have a home match against Chelsea. So we are versing Barcelona in the semis which is crazy. The other semi-finals match that is going on is against Paris Saint-Germain and Real Madrid. This is episode 34. I really can't believe that we are smashing this Newcastle career mode. We're in season 3 at the moment, uh, just to remind you guys. But make sure to leave a like for that. I hope you've been enjoying the career mode as much as I have. So, let's get into this match against Barca. And just want to quickly recap the last episode. What a, a big just collision there. I wanted to put that in. I love, like, the big hits and... Um, the stacks in football. But guys, just to quickly recap the last episode, we ended up winning 4-2 down at White Hart Lane against Tottenham Hotspur. It was a pretty decent victory. Jovetic ended up picking up man of the match and two goals. Matic picked up the other and Wellington Silva picked up another one here. But on the counter-attack here, look how much space Benzema gave De Stiglio. De Stiglio gets his shot off. Maybe if I had a, a bit more of a clinical player, it would have been better. But Wellington Silva, fresh off the bench, manages to get his shot off. But PK manages to save the day. And Benzema didn't save the day for us in the 90th minute. We end up drawing 0-0 against Barcelona. There were a couple of, a couple of early ch chances early on, both sides really couldn't take their chances. I was really unlucky not to score and we end up drawing nil-nil at home against Barca which I think is a really good, that's put us in a really good position to go down to the Camp Nou and really put the pressure on Barca to be in the finals of the Champions League. Also guys, we did draw the last match um, in the last episode nil-nil against Manchester United which was disappointing but hey you do that sometimes. So, we do have a lot of fixtures coming up. So, I have gone with my, my second squad. So, you're most welcome to pause and have a look at the changes. But we've brought on Tarat, Wellington Silva, who's just been a beast in the last couple of episodes. Absolutely fantastic. So, we'll be able to play a, a fully fit side for the next match. But Chelsea at home is always going to be difficult, seeing as we did draw against Manchester United. But if we can beat Chelsea here today, I don't expect to with my youth side. But uh, we'll soon find out. But to be quite honest, I think it's kind of realistic that we drew against Barca because we are a solid, we're a, we're a, a Premier League cl club, we, we're a top four club. We ended up winning last year, which is absolutely fantastic, the title. We have an 88 striker, but Jovetic will be an 83rd at least. <laughs> He's 83 overall, sorry. He should be an 85 at least. Obviously, Paul Pogba, Matic, Grenier and Remy Cabela are all 85 overall, which is absolutely fantastic. But uh, we are playing against Chelsea. Thorgan has it on the ball to his brother has it. So it's always good to see that we're three seasons in that they're actually playing Thorgan and Eden. Uh, we do manage to give a free kick in a very dangerous position here. Edison Gavani steps up, but he ends up uh, going with the fake shot. And Lindegaard, um, sorry not Lindegaard, Langerak. God, <laughs> managed to be not tested. We whip it into Gaston Ramirez, and his shot just goes wide past Courtois. Tarat on the ball finds Wanyama, who finds Wellington Silva, who feeds it off to Grenier, and Grenier with the finesse, and he is going to be a fantastic player for the future at Newcastle. Whether I'm not, whether or not I'm going to be here to see his improvement, we'll soon find out. But let me know in the comments, guys. Would you like to see season four of the Newcastle United career mode? Would you want me to accept a browse job offer? Move to a another club and then we could always come back to Newcastle of course I do plan to have this career mode until the end of FIFA 15 so I plan to do like at least 250 episodes or whatnot and we might get more in but Grenier makes it 1-0 we're 1-0 up against Chelsea with our youth side and Adele Tarad just before the 77th minute makes it 2-0 so I was really quite surprised he has the captain armband for this episode but like I said I was really quite surprised that we that we managed to uh, beat Chelsea with our second side here and uh, Courtois was not very <laughs> was in a pretty woeful situation and we end up quite comfortably winning 2-0 <laughs> we do manage to get it clear there but guys we are coming to the end of the episode thank you very much for watching if you've watched all the way through I really do appreciate it make sure to leave a like on this video support this series and my channel and I'll be bringing more FIFA 15 career mode tomorrow out for you guys thanks a bunch for watching SimC out